I remember the first time I saw it. Tried to find words to describe it. But I couldn't. Nothing had prepared me. Death is everywhere. It follows us like a stray dog, waiting to devour us like scraps. The pain it causes is so acute, so complete. It's hard to understand how it benefits us as a species. I remember stories of the Great War. How it seemed a man had lost all reason. We killed 5,000 men that day. When I say killing you means nothing to me, I mean it. That we'd become animals. We murdered him. First man I killed was just a boy. Younger than you. Or perhaps we just surrendered to the fact that animals is all we've ever been. I know what it feels like to hate the world. You don't want to feel it, honey. When you kill a thing, son, it makes you a little less man, a little more animal. But there are moments where I feel we are more. Now we try to find the balance between them. That's all life is. You deserve peace. You didn't say that. If possible, can describe a feeling. That's how I felt. The whole world felt possible. And I was ready for it. This trail is as free as you'll ever be. Freedom. To most, it is an idea. An abstract thought that pertains to control. That's not freedom. That's independence. Freedom is riding wild over untamed land with no notion any moment exists beyond the one you are living. The only rules you need to follow are the ones in your heart. How do you say I, I love you? Kamakuntala. <laughs> I know what I am now. I'm a cowboy. And yet, freedom has fangs. Death is everywhere on the prairie, in every form you can imagine. And if you, your worst nightmare couldn't muster. You gone mad. Wild like a rabid dog, scalped her, killed her husband, stuck her full of airs. What was I supposed to do? I'd known death since I was a child. But it had never touched me. It had never placed its rotten finger on my heart. Until today. I looked back at my father. 
and I studied his eyes. I look at you for what you are. Most important thing to me on this planet. I want to know my greatest fear about dying. It's being forgotten. Nobody's going to forget you, Elsa. That's when I knew I was going to die. <laughs> Looking back, there were two journeys. One, adventure and wonder. The other was filled with danger and death and despair. I look at the world through the hazy lens of fever. And now, it smiled at me. I understand it now. I understand what? I know what it is. I felt no fear. And it was beautiful. Once again.